up everybody? This is Tony with PressureWasher.com. Um, today we're gonna be unboxing the Simpson Clean Machine. Um, this is 3400. So we're gonna take a look at everything that comes, shows up when uh, this box hits your door. So this unit in and of itself weighs uh, 68 pounds. So all together wrapped up, it's almost 70. And it does come mostly pre-assembled. You see, we're going to uh, pull out the top portion of the handle here. 3,400 PSI, 2.5 gallons per minute. It's supposed to come with four different nozzles. So we'll take a look at that here shortly. Extraordinarily well protected. Lots of foam padding, plastic. Show you inside the box real fast. This whole unit comes with a gun. Pressure hose, wand extension, right here. Quick connect for the uh, tips. I will say everything in this box is really well packed to protect this as it does come pre-assembled. This has a maintenance-free axial pump on it. So you should never really have to change the oil in it, just on the pump side. Um, there is oil for the engine. Let me see if I can get this pull out in one pull. Uh-huh. Now, we have the pressure washer. Completely out. We've got a bag with all of our with our hose holder, um, as well as our siphon tube, and our bag with our tips in it, right here. So, get this open. Let's see how this all works. Set up here. Siphon tube, instruction manual. Another nifty part about this, this comes with a bag of oil ready to go so that you can put the oil in the machine. And this is just regular 10W30 um, and get off of the races. So let's finish putting this thing together. This may just be because of how they ship this, but there's torque screws here. This one right here is a little offset. Let me see if I can get you in a little bit closer. This one here, notice how it's just a little bit off. That is stopping our bolt to attach our wand holder to the handle. What we're gonna do is we have grabbed a T30 
It's gonna pop this loose real fast. I'm not going to take these all the way out. I'm just going to try to see if I can get enough in there to maneuver that around and have it sit flush. And it looks as though this was just an issue of quick assembly because everything lines up really, really well. Um, I'll be able to put this back very easily, but I will also say, ooh, Dude, that is threaded bad. Okay, cool. That's something to look out for. this quick assembled. Take off these protective caps on here. Nice and broke. Now, aside from connecting the water up and putting the fluids in this thing, it's ready to go. So as mentioned before, this is the bolt that I had an issue with. When I opened this up, this was a little bit crooked. It's kind of shoved in there. It looks like it may have been threaded off initially when it was packaged, but I had to undo that so that I could get this bolt here in for, into, for the um, wand holder attached. It wouldn't seat. As you can see on this side, that's how it attaches, it just screws in there, and it just, um, it just couldn't do it. You will see here also, this comes with a cool little Velcro hose holder. That's pretty sweet, so. Keep this hose wrapped up out of the way, looking solid for storage. But everything else about this, it's a beautiful looking pressure washer. Really easy to put together, um, maybe about 10 minutes total, not including running to go get, um, to go look for my T30 because they always get lost inside my toolbox for some reason. Um, 
as mentioned before, about $369 retail at any of the local hardware stores. Um, comes with your siphon tube if you want to add some soap. Again with the uh, 10W30 motor oil. And that's it. That's the Simpson Clean Machine 3400. We'll be doing a review here shortly to let you know how it performs. For more information, check out pressurewasher.com.